Dad, I think we have new neighbors. Let's get out of here before this gets too crazy. Scrub Bub Barrage. One couple in a garage. You're probably wondering why I've called you all down to this family meeting. Well, it's because I can't stand being around Karen anymore. So we are going down to San Diego for a few days to cool off. But what about school? Jacob, it's the middle of summer break. Oh, right. So let's get packed up and hit the road. Mother, it looks like the Sagans are escaping. Thanks for the update, Seth Abel. Everyone, to the minivan. Hello, and welcome to the San Diego Inn. We have a reservation under the name Sagan. All right, we have you down right here. Two adults, two children, two nights. Enjoy your stay. All right, here's our room. Mom, Dad, can we go to the beach after we unpack? Of course. It's so relaxing swimming in the ocean. I know, right? Come on in, Jacob. No thanks, I'm good. Excuse me, but what on earth do you think you are doing? We are swimming in the ocean? Why? Because you are not allowed to swim in it. Why not? Because I own the ocean and only me, my husband, and our three boys may swim in it. <laughs> Well, that's stupid. No one owns the ocean. That's not entirely true, Dad. Sovereign states own up to 200 nautical miles of the ocean off their shores, and the rest is governed by the United Nations Convention on the Law of the Sea. Shut up, nerd. None of that mumbo-jumbo matters because I own the ocean. Yeah. If my mom says she owns the ocean, then she owns the ocean. Look, Karen. We came here to spend a few days away from you. Would you please go back to Beyond City and leave us alone? Well, would you please get out of my ocean? Karen, for the last time, this isn't your ocean. Now leave us alone or we're calling the Coast Guard. Oh my god. Help. Help. These people are trying to drown us. Help. Help. I am Coast Guard. What seems to be the trouble? Thank god you're here. All I did was ask this family if me, my husband, and my three boys could swim in the ocean with them, and they called us all kinds of foul names and the little girl in the floaty tried to drown my twins. Please arrest them. That is not true, officer. Karen and her family came onto the beach and demanded my parents and sister to get out of the ocean because she thinks she owns it. I reported the whole incident on my tablet. Can I see your tablet, son? Sure. Here you go. I have seen all I need to see to issue a lifetime ban to one of the families here today. Oh, good. Hope you've packed your picnic basket and folded your beach towels, Sagans. Actually, it is you, McCarrens, who are now banned for life. Now look here mister, my mom can do whatever she wants. But I didn't do anything. Now get off this beach before I throw you all in jail. Even the children. Come on. McCarrens, let's have a barbecue. We'll find a family having a barbecue and tell them it's our barbecue. I'm so sorry you had to put up with that. Every week someone like that comes onto this beach and claims they own the ocean. Well, we're Sagans, and we can handle anything. <laughs>